Did did they give you my Pepsi? My Coke? Um, it wasn't a October 5th for me. I hope you're having a good day. Uh, I took yesterday off because of my back troubles that I was having, but now I'm back. I'm still a little sore, but I feel like if I do less, it's gonna hurt my back more. So, I, you know, I need to get out and get active. You know what I'm saying? So, I took that day off. I think I left the house once to roll up the windows because it was gonna rain, and that was about it. So, fired up today um, we're ready to stay positive even when negativity comes our way we're gonna stay positive um, I'm done with that so we're gonna be good today we're gonna have a good time we have an order for McDonald's on Monroe uh, Monroe's a bit of a the McDonald's on Monroe's it could be slow at times <clears throat> And be, in a quarter mile, turn right on South MacArthur Boulevard. Yeah, yeah. They can be a little cranky and 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 purposely not make the orders. Sometimes I've noticed that that they'll. They, I mean, most people recognize what a person's a dasher or a delivery person. So, and if if you just rub them the wrong way, which is why I don't know if you've ever noticed, I try not to hang out on counters and you know, I try not to stare at the people and you know that kind of stuff, so that. They don't get annoyed with me and purposely don't make my order. So I've had this trouble with with this McDonald's on Monroe. Um, they've renovated the place, so they can't even see you there most of the time now. <clears throat> so it's up to them, really, if they want to make the, the orders. They'll print out the receipt saying that the order's ready, but they won't exactly rush to make the orders, you know what I mean? Go to McDonald's on Monroe. Thank you. What the heck is that? Ooh, bird poo. So I've, I've told you in the past that so what I usually do is whenever I get an order from some place, I'll go back to that place or to that area so that, cause maybe that's, you know, that's where the orders are coming from. And it usually works pretty well for me. It just gives me some thing to do as to opposed to just driving around and just, you know, aimlessly or whatever. So that's what I do. I'll go back there for like three minutes and then move on to the next place and that kind of thing. Except for Monroe. <laughs> But well, the stuff in Monroe, I don't like to go there. I mean, it's not that bad, but it's just, you know, like I was telling you, that McDonald's is kind of slow sometimes. So I, I, I don't go back there whenever I get orders from there. So um, I just delivered that McDonald's and I got another order for that same area for Krispy, Krispy Kreme. It's right next to it, right next to that McDonald's we were just at. So Krispy Kreme is probably the best business there as far as getting your orders on time goes. So that should be pretty good. So we're gonna go to Krispy Kreme, pick this up. Here we go. Good morning. I'm picking up an order for Amanda. Thank you. You yeah, have a good day. Thanks. There you go, sir. Wow. 
Okay, so I was delivering, about to deliver, uh, well, maybe it was about a block away from the delivery address. I got an order for that same McDonald's. I can't get away from this area, which is fine as long as the orders are good enough and as long as they're coming out on time. It's great. In a quarter Wonderful. Right on old Jacksonville. Fantastic. So, I'm, I'm kind of far away, so hopefully it'll be ready again. I'm... The last time I didn't turn off the car because I was still at home when I got the order and I figured it would be ready and it was pretty close to being ready. If you do DoorDash or any kind of food delivery or any kind of deliveries, I don't recommend you leaving your car on ever, but that's what I did. This time, however, I think I'm going to turn off the car because, I don't know, I'm about the same distance. I don't know how many items I have. I have six items. Or Beth Ann. So... But I'm still gonna turn off the car. And it's for Uber Eats if I didn't say. So here we go. Got that blue car? You got that blue car out there? Uh, yeah, it's a boost. Left it running, huh? huh? You left it running? Yeah, we got That's one of the second. I don't leave it running on this one. <laughs> Takes too long here. Yeah, I don't got one. And McDonald's on a big bottle of time. Good morning, ma'am. I have the F45, the Uber Eats order. That's All right. up there. Okay. There, we're getting them now. We're just waiting on hash browns. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. You got a good one now. You two can be good tomorrow with that game. Now. Yes, ma'am. You know, I'm be front and center. <laughs> <laughs> All right, boy. Yes, ma'am. Uber Eats. What's the last three? F45. Thank you. Good luck to you, buddy. That gentleman was there before I was, and somehow I got my order before him. So that place is a bit of a bit of a mess. So now I have an order for Burger King, which is right across the way here. Then I'm gonna go pick up this place. It's pretty similar. Now sometimes this place is locked in the morning, and I have to go through the drive-through. But I'm gonna still try and go through the store. Um, this place, this Burger King in particular, got me uh, some nice views on a short that I made. <laughs> a lady who wasn't very talkative. It was just fine sometimes, you know. Sometimes I'm not very talkative. I'm very talkative today, as you can see. Or here. But, anyway, I appreciate her for that. So let's go. Let's go here.
<laughs> uh, Ember. I am, but that's not my order there. That was an order for Mindy. That's what it is. What is it? Mindy. Thank you. That was too heavy. Come on. The screen is stuck. <laughs> Come on, you. Good morning. You awesome. Thank, Thank you, you so for the directions. They're very helpful. Thank, Thank you. you very Thanks. much. Have a good day. My magnet was getting cut in my throat. Anyway, I have an order for that special place in my heart. You know, a lot of the places that I go to, this, this place is one of the places that I like to go. The Iron, you may have heard of it. I may have mentioned it once or twice. I like going to this place because of the people that work there. Everybody's very nice. You know, some people more than other, of course. Anyway, we're going to heavy <laughs> for three items. Looks like some poppables. I'm trying to do that. I'm just trying to stop myself from doing that sound too. I notice it a lot when I do my editing. I don't know if it's because I have gum in my mouth or what it is. But yeah, I'm trying to stop that. So sorry about that. So, as I was saying, I have an order two order for a high B for two lace poppables potato snacks. Sea salt flavor is very important that I get the sea salt, not the other kind. And a 12 pack of Coke. It's a, it's a very big order. I'm, I'm hopefully. In a quarter mile, turn right on. A certain person works on the weekends. I won't say their name. Um, so Uber wants to add another order for Walgreens. And I'm not taking that. So let's go to Heavy. Set for two for five. It's a good price. Uh, I mean, the bags are small, but these bags used to be bigger. Hey Quinn, how are you? You happy to be here today? Yeah. <laughs> as happy as you can be, huh? See you later, Quinn.
Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. You know, I wanted to talk about Quinn. Quinny there at the self checkouts. He's always at the self checkouts. He's a nice kid. Um, I, I get the feeling that he just doesn't like me. So every now and then I'll just stop talking to him. And then this morning he said hello to me first. So I, I was just gonna do my things, got my stuff. You know, we talked about the whole thing about him being happy and all that stuff. And then I say, see you later. I'll turn right on South Grand Avenue West using the right. And then I say, see you later. <laughs> oh, come on. And he doesn't say anything. Like he acts like it doesn't. He just ignores me. So I don't know. I I, I can't get a, a grasp on what what's going on with Quinny. I even stopped calling him Quinny. Thought that maybe that offended him. But I'm going back to it. It's Quinny again. Anyway, we're still trying to drop out this high beam. Pretty close to high beam still. So got a while to go. <laughs> Good morning. I was about to ring your doorbell. Good morning. <laughs> Thank you. There's the handle there. Thank you. You have a good day. I'll close this for you. I have a Uber Eats order for Van Tuttle Parts. I don't get a lot of those. You know that. If you don't know that, turn you, I'll turn left where I want to, lady. If you didn't know that, now you know. They're usually not very good orders. I don't know how I'm going the right way. Sometimes it's hard to tell whether the roads are one ways or not here. So and this one's a particularly new road that, been, that had been closed for the last couple of years. So it's a very nice road. Anyway, we're going to advance out of parts. I don't know what the items are. I'm like, it's not some big old battery because I'm still recouping from this back troubles, tie rod and whatever that is. Go to there. Advanced Auto Parts. So I'm still on my way to the Advanced Auto Parts, but I got another um, offer from Uber for Panera that I just took. So we're gonna go do that. I turned up DoorDash. Um, I'm still on Platinum after this morning. Uh, this morning I wasn't, but now I am. So I just turned it off, so I don't have to worry about pausing and unpausing that stuff. And then as soon as I'm done with these two orders, I'll turn it back on. Hey, right, we're still going to Advanced Auto Parts. It's right over there. It's a bit far though, but it's right over there. You have to take my word for it, I guess. Hello there. Hello. I have an Uber order that I'm picking up. Yeah. To, for TFG. Yeah. Thank you. an order for Dan. Uh, Dan. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Have a good day. I don't have a delivery. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hello there. Good morning. Mm. Is that? And there's this one. Thanks. Have a good day. Thanks. So I went home for about an hour. Charge the batteries, you know, all that stuff. Spend time with Dukes. He was 
KK wasn't awake yet, so I hung out with Dukes, you know, watch some some videos on the YouTube, you know what I'm saying? Some happy stuff, some sad stuff, all kinds of stuff. Anyway, now I have an order for for high B for three items for alcohol. I don't know what they are yet. I guess I could look. Watch out, lady. Are you trying to hit me? Oh. Some kind of Oh, I guess it's a rosé again. Maybe it's one of that one lady. What do you think? Anyway, let's go to the, let's go to Hy-Vee and get some alcohol. Oh, How you doing? Not too bad. It was really good out there, you know, the barbecue with the guy over there. Yeah. Yeah, customer appreciation. Was that, are they free? I think so. Right? Oh, they I better have so. I got a birthday coming up next week on the 11th. <laughs> so I'm thinking about doing a little grilling, you know. I think somebody should grill for me. What do you think? Yeah. It's my birthday. <laughs> you know? I'm gonna be 45. What do you think? Pretty good. I still look like I'm 20, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you later. <laughs> found the, the, the right stuff this time that's <laughs> nice it's a lot of times you know they're out of you have a good day thanks you too so i have an order for two orders i have an order for popeyes and for what was the other place core life eatery they're right next to each other right behind me so i gotta get turned around somewhere how i can't get over here so i'm not the pull you kind of your turn somewhere else yeah, I'll see you. I gotta go to Popeyes first, so let's do that. Oh, that's not the window. Uh. Welcome to Popeyes. Okay, I just have a DoorDash order for Jessica. Pull around. I forgot that my windows don't roll down, so I look ridiculous, but. I'll have to fix it later. Thank you. Thank you. I have a DoorDash order for Abe Lardo's that I just took. Um, so this one kind of puts us at our, kind of puts me at my goal, but I'm gonna leave it on on the way home. See if I get a little bit extra for tonight, you know what I'm saying? So let's go to Abe Lardo's, everybody.
Sí, hola, tengo orden de DoorDash. Sí, sí. Tengo orden de DoorDash. Ok, pase a la vuelta, por favor. Hoy. Ok. Pero la ventana. Ah, se me descompuso, sí. sí hay que Oye, abrirla, ¿No venden las camisas? ¿Eh? ¿Venden las camisas? No. No, ah, pues deberían de venderla. ¿Qué te las compran? Sí. Yo la compraría. Bueno, sí. nos vemos. Gracias. ¿Quieres una? Deja la, ¿Sí? la otra. A ver, a, la, para la próxima, una sí. de una X. Deja ver si tengo. Ah, pues, pues, para, para la próxima. Sí, déjale pues. So I got an order for Crackle. <laughs> Hold on, let me buckle. <sighs> okay, so I got an order for Crackle. Um, that's gonna be the last one of the day for sure. Hold on, let me let me make sure of it. Um, my home, my phone's overheating, so that's probably why it's gonna be the end of the day. That's the only reason. Otherwise, I would have kept going. Oh. Anyway, let's go to Crackle, everybody. I have a DoorDash order for Wendy. Oh. There you go. Thank you. Hi, Wendy. How are you? Good. Good. I like this weather. What's okay, up? Well, you, you, oh, I was letting you know, it, it, but you dropped yeah. off before, so, yeah. I like for delivering too, because I, I, like, I like familiar faces, so thank you. Did, did they give you my Pepsi, my Coke? Um, it wasn't a... Yep, right here, one soda large. I'm sorry, Wendy. That's okay. I'll just have to um, um, yeah. request a credit. There's not two in. I don't know what. I don't know what happened. Yeah. I felt like there was two. They they, they went. They, got, they had the food ready, and then they went and got something from the ice cream. So that's probably what distracted me. I'm sorry about that. The, the, that's okay. I'll just. I'll let you down. No, 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 no. That's okay. I'll just request a credit. And what was it? Like a large Coke? Large Pepsi. Large Pepsi. Oh, yeah, you want. You know what? Now on, because I always, I, 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 I normally let the door down yeah. because it seems like that's the one thing. That gets forgotten it's the soda but um i'll go ahead and i'll just remember next time to let the doordash know uh, i really soda. that's really what happened i she went and got the ice cream from somewhere else so i i probably it's just probably that's you know okay. my simple mind i guess wendy i'm sorry okay, about that that's okay. you have a good day. thank you you too <laughs> yeah but yeah you got your refund hopefully right oh, yeah, okay I, I, I ordered, uh, it's just, I, it wasn't the Uber or the, or the um, right. Dash fault because they bagged with seal. Right. But they, yeah, so they'll just give me a credit. I'll put it towards something else. Okay, I'll see you later. Oh, Sorry okay. about this. <laughs> I am. <laughs> oh no, I let Wendy down. Oh. You saw what happened. I asked for the order. She ran around and got some other thing. And so I didn't, oh, it, it threw me off. So I didn't look to see that there was a drink on there. I hate to let Wendy down. Of all people, she's a very nice lady. She's always been very nice to me. That's what happens. Maybe, was, well, blame it on the heat that I was getting to me. What do you think? I owe Wendy a drink. So anyway, that's gonna be it for us, everybody. Uh, I think this is my way home. Uh, thanks for watching.
Thanks for subscribing, doing all this stuff, sharing, hopefully. I appreciate you. The names I recognize, the names I don't recognize. I'll recognize you if you keep up, you know, commenting and doing that kind of stuff. I appreciate you. Don't forget to drive like you stole it.